Hi, my name is Dr. Remy Amataya with the Women's Care Clinic and welcome to Wellness Wednesday. HPV stands for human papillomavirus, and it is a sexually transmitted virus. The tricky thing about the HPV virus is that it's not typically screened for um, or tested for, and so there's not a clear-cut way to know when or how you contracted it. Um, what we do know is that it is spread via sexual contact, so that be either anal or vaginal sex, as well as it can be spread via skin-to-skin -skin contact. HPV does not directly cause cancer, but it can increase your risk for developing different types of cancers. And those types of cancers include cervical cancer, vaginal cancer, vulvar cancer, penile cancer, throat cancer, as well as anal cancer. In addition to cervical cancer, you can also develop genital warts from different lower risk HPV strains. When you come to your OBGYN for your pap smears, we are screening for the HPV virus. One of the good things about HPV is that we have a vaccine that covers these strains of HPV. We do actually recommend that children do get the vaccine, preferably before they're sexually active, between the ages of 9 to 12, given that as a parent um, or as a guardian, you may not be sure as to when your child is actually going to be sexually active. Another positive note is that the HPV vaccine can actually help protect women um, from future infertility issues as it pertains to the development of a cervical cancer or a cervical precancer. The HPV vaccine is very safe. There's no harmful ingredients in the vaccine and it has already been given to 270 million people worldwide as well as 120 million people in the U.S.